Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley says he has to remain quiet when it comes to policing in this country because it's not his job to tell the officers what to do. It's the job of the police commissioner. Speaking during the first conversation with the people in the Aruka Maloney constituency last night, Dr. Rowley said it is for the top cop to take control of the service, especially since Parliament has given him the power to discipline the officers and wean out the corrupted ones. Like you, I too am watching with anger at some of the things I'm seeing and I dare not open my mouth, especially since I'm Prime Minister. Because you could say that it goes unnoticed, but if I say it, it's for, it's for head, headline news. And the last thing we want to do is to do anything to further demoralize the police service. On the contrary, we do everything we can to bolster and to give them the support to go out there. He said Trinidad and Tobago will not lose the fight against the criminal elements. As it stands, there are about 6,000 full-time police officers and 2,000 special reserved officers. According to Dr. Rowley, this is above the world average based on the amount of citizens in the country. It is not that we have not been providing resources to the police service. It is not that we have not provided human person, um, resources or financial resources. It is just that there are a whole series of tangled systems which are guaranteed not to give you the result that you are looking for. And what we have been doing is trying to untangle those arrangements and we have started to do that by putting in place this manpower audit of the police service. Prime Minister Dr. Rowley also said police officers can become overwhelmed when dealing with crime. If you have a certain amount of policemen in the homicide department, in the, in the police service, as we do, we have a homicide department, and you have four murders for the weekend, and you deploy the homicide officers to pursue investigations on those four murders, before they begin to wet their feet in the investigation, you have four more. And then the following weekend, you have another four. You know what you're heading to? You quickly come to a situation where the police with the best will in the world is overwhelmed by the size of the assignment. Meanwhile, he said there will be no state of emergency in this country. He said January has normally been a month which has seen over 40 murders in recent time. In 2012, there were 48, just four more as compared to 2017.